I almost felt like it was it was meant to be. I had the run of my life and it was just the last jump left. He's very lucky that he's got the support in place that he's had to be able to come back because um, some athletes don't come back from that injury. You don't really know how much you lost in eight to nine months off the bike. You can't really practice the contest feeling. When you stand up there with all the crowd and obviously a bit nervous, a little bit scared, you never really get that feeling when you ride at home. So I just wanted to go to a contest and practice it a little bit for the, for the big events. Time to check out the course and uh, meet all the homies again. Been way too long. Perfecto. You can't really compare this feeling on top to anything ever. It's like so much adrenaline mixed with like terrifying feelings mixed with happiness to be back. That's so good. It's really good. We're sure we're During qualifying, I just felt a little bit shaky. I um, missed a little bit on both of my runs. Still no result. It's been 15 minutes. Perfect. Oh, great. Congratulations <laughs> <laughs> was just super lucky to qualify in 12th place, which uh, was just on the bubble to make it to the finals. My goal to go here was just to come here, have fun, and feel the competition vibe again. And, uh, Going into the final meant that I could ride another day and have some more fun. Yeah, it was definitely a different feeling standing on the start. Normally, I have so much pressure on myself that outside of the top three, it's like not good and a disaster. And now I just was standing up there and just wanted to ride and um, didn't want to get injured again. So I was probably as nervous, but for a totally different reason. Landing the last run was actually really like emotional. I just uh, felt a big stone dropping from my chest, and uh, yeah, I was just thinking about all the all the hard work that I've put down to get back to this point. It was just the best case scenario, and my uh, self confidence was growing. And um, the next contest after that, I think I had um, three podiums out of four starts. So uh, I just felt like I was exactly where I where I wanted to be. Then um, went too far on the jump and put my foot down. Yeah, twisted my ankle and foot pretty bad. And I could feel straight away that it wasn't good. I could feel how the swelling started right away and uh, broken foot again and uh, off the bike for another three to four months. In one way, the first time around, it was a lot easier because I, I didn't know how much hard work I would have to go through to, to come back to the top. But this time I know exactly what I have to do and also that it's possible. I think it would have been a lot harder if I wouldn't have done the comeback and had those good results. At least this time I have the whole winter to prepare and. I don't have to feel that, that stress again. Now I'll just ride my bike as much as possible and hope that it will work out better this time.